Hello and welcome back to modded minecraft with me SK Drake How you guys doing? I'm doing great Alright last episode I ended it with me uh, having some issues with railcraft I got those sorted out and I'll show you in a minute um, Some changes I made I like ran the quarry all the way down to bedrock The only issue is these uh, mod useful DNS ores you got this one, you got bones, you got full gold and full iron. The quarry mines some of it, but not all of it for some reason. Don't know what's causing that, but that's what happens with the quarry. So you can see the ore spread out. If I get to a wall somewhere. And you can see the cave systems. The ore is pretty good. I'll show you everything I've gotten from this. And I added uh, four more of these and I actually need four of these. Give me these. Um, this world is always noon, but it does rain. So when it rains, the solar panels don't work and I have no power. Uh, let's see. Got the cobble running into the ender chest. Oh, the dimensional anchors. I made these. So that uh, this keeps this area loaded. The quarry, if I don't keep this world loaded when I leave, the quarry won't run. So I put in these dimensional anchors. They're really easy to make. Anchor. There's a whole bunch. But yeah, these are the ones I use. It's a block of iron and some gold. Really easy to make. And you can set them up. I got this set to 25 chunks in area 5x5. Five five. If you press F9. No, not F9. F9, 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 F9. Go oh, away. There we go. F6. Yeah, F6. Okay, there we go. You can see all the chunks that are loaded. And it loaded the whole quarry in this area over here. I'm going to have to change it for loading this quarry over here. And you see it's not loading the whole thing. But this whole quarry is loaded. Actually, I think if I when I move the quarry over here, it's going to load all that. Let's find out real quick. Oh, a little bit of lag. All right, get you out of here. Give me that. I already laid out the grid for this. It's uh, 64, 64, same exact size as that one. Whoa, laggy. Alright, so yeah, now the whole quarry is loaded. You see, the quarry is keeping that chunk loaded, and the ones with the red squares are loaded by the anchor. Alright, let's go grab my... Where are they? Where, where'd they go? Oh, there it is. Come here, you. One there, and do I have one out here? Oh, no, I think it's over here. Yeah, it's over here. Oops, not that button, that button. Grab my landmines. Um, I figured out the issue with the... Blah, blah, blah. I figured out the issue with... Uh... There you go, leave those there. This way I don't lose them and they're always where I need them. With this here. Dun dun, I'm sure you blah. I got this all set up now. Once uh, the cart is full, it's on a booster track and uh, get out of the way. There you go. You see the booster track, the arrow is facing that way. So once the cart is full, complete it's going to emit a redstone signal to the booster track and the booster track is going to shoot off not the booster boarding track boarding track it's going to shoot the card out and these item loaders pull directly from any inventory adjacent to them so with the ender chest right there it's going to load these up one of these is enough for one quarry i had two just because I want to run two quarries at a time once I get to that spot. And they just run down these tracks. 
These are the booster tracks, and I got empowered to shoot across the bridge. Uh, let's take a little nap. You see here, this is where it gets unloaded by the unloaders. Again, with the boarding tracks facing the opposite way. And I put in these uh, train buffers. Instead of having like a block there, these look much better. Let's take a nap real quick before I get blown up by a creeper. And these are... Oh yeah, the other issue was I was trying to use uh, mechanical pipes instead of logical transporter pipes. Mechanical pipes are for liquid, logical transporter are for items. And I hooked up this, is set up to pull out of all four inventories. Just because it wasn't keeping up. It, it wasn't pulling out fast enough. It pulls one block at a time. So with all four of them connected, it pulls four at a time. Got some deep storage. That's how much gravel. That's how much uh, cobble. That's how much dirt. And how much limestone I've gotten out of the quarry. And I smelted up one block of iron, or one stack of iron ore. But this is all the stuff here. Smelted up one stack of gold ore that was here. The, the bones, the gold nuggets. Raw iron and the the canny sodium gem are all from the mod useful DNS, which it doesn't mind all of them, all the blocks, but it does mind some. So I'm getting some of it, just not all of it. But here you can see I got tons and tons of stuff. Diamonds, I got a stack here, tons of redstone and sulfur. Sulfur is gonna be very useful. More redstone, almost a half stack of diamond, dark iron, not a whole lot of silicone. Palantite ore. And this the last chest, the last of it. Um, oh, I uh, yeah, here, here you can see I ran, finally finished that up when I was AFK. This is all the stuff it will not uh, process. So all this stuff cannot be processed. Um, what else? Oh, I built, I built the storage and the ore processing building. It's, uh, chisel blocks. I got some micro stone post and fur strips. Let's give a nice little decoration. You see, it, these are all half slabs, so nothing can spawn on the top. And I'll have to put lights up there. But it's just a nice little simple design. And... I got another uh, dimensional anchor here to keep this area loaded so that when I'm in the other dimension AFK for the quarry this place is still processing everything and this so and there's a hole down here for the basement this started a little basement area it's not a whole lot but I want the ore processing to go over here and storage is actually going to be underneath. I'm going to put all the deep storage down here. Because I want deep storage for every single type that comes out of the quarry underneath. And I'm going to have an ME system up here to display everything that I get. And I'm going to need... First thing we're going to do is finish upgrading this. Because right now it's a tier 3... Which is tripling ores, but it goes all the way up to tier 5. So I've prepped, I've done some prep work. I pop that, I've made all this stuff here. One, two, three. Or I don't have nearly enough copper. I'm going to have to do some more, but first we're going to do the tier 4. Which requires salination, electric separator, electrolytic separator, chemical infuser, and chemical injection. So, mech. Electrolytic separator. Bloop. We need this thing. So we go like that. We go... Bam, 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 bam. I don't have any uh, iron dust. I thought I made iron dust. Oh no, 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 tell me, I didn't forget the iron dust, I forgot the iron dust, project off, give me, I put all the iron in here, 
iron do there we go 16 should be plenty hopefully throw this in here there we go all right let that run come over here and make this guy all right we got that need that so we go red red Made a whole bunch of supplies, probably not nearly enough, but yeah, I'm trying here. All right, electrolytic separator. Next is, uh, what did I say? So a salination, a chemical infuser, and a chemical injection. Chemical infuser, this thing. You need a dynamic tank, which is cobblestone, which I don't have. Well, I do have. I have a whole bunch of cobblestone. Give me that. Alright. Alright. So cobblestone with steel makes it a dynamic tank. Makes eight dynamic tanks to be precise. Chemical infuser. We need two of these. That's iron dust. And I didn't. Prep that. Silly me. Silly me. I thought I was all good to go, but I wasn't. Inject on. <laughs> oh. Ugh. Dogs want to bark at nothing. Alright. What was I doing? Uh, I was making this thing. I forgot what I was saying. One, two. Chemical infuser. Go like that. We go. No, no, no. I need to make two of these first. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. Bam, bam. One of you. You go there. You go there. And like so. Chemical infuser. And last was chemical injection chamber. Two steel casings. Alright, we can make those. One, two. One two, one two, one two, one two, one two. Chemical injector. We need a purification chamber. Chemical injector needs a purification chamber, which needs an enrichment chamber. Which all right, so we need to make two more of these. One two. One two, one two. Bam bam. We need to make steel block, steel casing rather. All right, and then we grab these, grab four of these. I have nowhere near enough materials. All right, enrichment chamber we made. This needs two of these. So let's see, one, two. One two, one two, one two. One two, one two. One two, one two. And I need some diamonds. Which I have in here. Give me these. I already used up all my diamonds. One two. One two. Okay. Then what else do we need for the purification chamber? We need four of these. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Here we go. Bam, 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 bam. Two of these. One of these. Two of these. Purification chamber. Now we can make the chemical injection chamber. We need four of these. Uh, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. This is quite expensive. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and four. Okay, grab you, put you back, and we should be able to make it purification chamber to steal. Nope. We need two of these. I'm gonna run out of those. 
One, two. Here we go. This goes here. This goes here. Uh, da, da, da. All right. So we got this, this, and this. And we need this. Which requires steel casing for those. Block of copper. Okay. For these. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Two steel casings. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. One, two. And a block of copper. Alright. Block of copper. Four of these. Uh, two of these. And one of these. Or two of those. We got a controller. We need two of these, which is two dynamic valves. So, see. Hold on a second. There, right, we're back. Uh, where was I? I was making. I need to make two of these. One, two, one, two. One, two. Steel, two, 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 two. Two dynamic. Oh. They make two. Alright. <coughs> Excuse me. No, I need to make two of those. Yeah, that's right. That was right. One. No. <laughs> Uh, let's try this again. Hopefully the dogs don't freak out again. Uh, I need two of these like I said. We need a steel casing. Yeah. We need two of these. One, two. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Okay. What else do we need? For those, bam, oh, we're running really low. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Bam, we go there, there. Two there, and two there. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Perfect. It's two valves. <coughs> and the rest are these which is a dynamic tank surrounded by copper and it takes 16 for the bottom layer uh, let's see uh, how do I make this okay steel Let's make it as many as we can. Forty. Forty. Yeah. These are so expensive. Forty-seven. All right. Ooh. Okay. This. Is everything you need for tier four? <clears throat> so let's uh, get this set up. Take a little nap. Um, uh, Salvation tank first. I want these. It's gonna go in right here. Yeah, one, two, three, four, two, three, four. With that, four, two, three, four, two, three, four. All right, I want the valves to go here. Then you just work up the ring, like so. You can go up to eighteen blocks tall total. Da, da, da. I need two, four, 
six, seven for the top. So this is the highest we can go right now. So we do that, 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 that. The controller right there. And we need these go here. Why can't I put them on? Wait, why is, why you no why you no go? Okay, there we go. This way. There we go. Got two of them set in there. Three. Oh, is this in the way? Oh, it's gonna suck if this is in the way. How much it it goes all the way to here. So I think I have to get rid of this too. Oh, get out of here, you. Yeah, hey, uh, it sticks out here. There we go. Okay, yeah, that, those were in the way. Oh. There we go. Alright, what can we put back? Can we put this back. Looks like it. Alright, what if we, we gotta put this here? This here. There we go. I can't put it there, okay. Uh hover. There we go. We can put you back. We can't put you and you back. Okay. That, that's fine. That's fine, that's fine. Okay. Alright, so now this is our salination controller. Water needs to go in and stuff comes out. So the stuff that comes out is going to feed into our electrolytic separator which is going to sit here. There we go. I want you to face that way. Okay. Get you out of the way. All right, let's go grab all these machines. Do do. Did I smelt her? Uh, we're gonna have to. This is gonna be the line of machines. Starting here. All right. Uh -huh. Put a torch right there. Just take out this whole line here. And bring some cable. Give me all this stuff. Uh, just give me some power. Uh, give me. There we go. There. Just a little bit. Alright, so. Uh, get you out of the way, get you out of the way. Elite Universal Cable. Gonna go here. Do like that. Get you out of the way. Smelter. Get this stuff out of the way. Next up is enrichment. All right, we can go crusher, enrichment chamber. 
put you here. Crush your enrichment chamber, and then purification chamber. All right, we got this. You go here. Then the chemical injection chamber, I believe, is the next one. Yes. And that's where the ore is going to go in. Chemical injection chamber. Which is going to get this. For right now. Oh, I got the chest right there. That's the tier 4. We just need to get oxygen into this. Which we need to... Clear out all this. Clear me out some workroom here. Da, 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 da. Right, let's make some room. If I go straight this way, I should. Yep, there we go. So, all right, so I need to clear out the rest of this basement here, and I will come back when that is done, and we will set up the rest of this. We we'll get all the plumbing in here and everything. All right, all right. I did some digging out, and I realized that I have a basic energy circuit which I need to upgrade to the ultimate so grab you grab you and you I made everything for it so you guys didn't have to watch me grab the same things over and over again oh because it has energy in it Jesus oh laggy how do I empty this thing? Hold on a second. Lag. Alright. I think I got the frame rate issue fixed. I just finished uh, emptying out the basic energy cube. Let's grab that. Uh, I'll explain this in a minute. Don't you worry. It would all make sense. Oh, I moved my bed too. There were too many creepers sneaking up on me. Trying to get the drop on me, it don't work. Come on now. Oh, uh, yeah. Move stuff around. Yeah, put that back there. We there we go. That's better. Alright, so we need this thing. We throw our empty in there. Why, why did it make? Oh, you gotta upgrade each one. Oh, son of a... Son of a... Okay, so you can't go to basic all the way up. Ah, oh, dang it. Alright, so that is this, this. We need two of those. One, two, one, two, one, two. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. One, two. That, 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 that. No, this one. There we go. Advanced. Now we need to make the elite, which is this. Which is four of these. One, two, three, four. Four. Then we need to make uh, two of these. 